Okay, so. Now I have my microphone in the right position. Okay, so. I really liked Lords of the Fallen. And I was genuinely disappointed when that didn't get a sequel, but instead there was a spiritual successor called The Surge. And this will be the first time <clears throat> that I have played The Surge to any reasonable extent. I've started the game and walked around in it a little bit, but nothing, uh, nothing very extensive. So, watching my brother play, um, Bloodborne. It's got me wanting to play Souls Likes, so. Kristen! Welcome! I'm gonna fuck around with the. Yeah, we're gonna turn the master volume down considerably. Medbay music? Ah. Oh. Ah, interesting. Okay. All right. Nope, we're going new game. Yep. We're going to override all that shit. Please delete the... Oh, well, fuck it. We'll go to slot two then. <clears throat> Hello. Mel, welcome! <clears throat> Sorry, welcome! Um, somebody tell me how is the game sound to voice ratio here? Um, is it good? Is it balanced? Can you hear me in the game okay? Should I adjust anything? Welcome! Welcome! Hi! Ah, that's what I said. Hi, <clears throat> and I'm glad to see you. Rio, you know who we are. Or at least you think we Everywhere you turn, we're there. Whether you see us or not. Maybe it's time to take a closer look. Creo is one of the world's largest manufacturers of consumer and industrial products, but we're so much more. And that's why you're here. At Creo, we're always reaching for the stars. We've always had our eyes on the big picture. to the 
Here we go, and we're gonna get up, and whoa, whoa, I wasn't expecting that. The first time, anyway. Welcome to Creo. We're happy to welcome you as part of our ever expanding family. Please proceed directly to registration. If you believe you can move mountains, Creo has the job for you. Because as a heavy operator, you can literally do that. Pure power, relentless performance, nothing can hold you back. Are you ready? Then join us as a heavy operator and save tomorrow today. Yeah, I'm probably going to go with that. Let me, let's go check what the other one does. If you like living life in the fast lane, Creo provides you with the highway to success as a field technician. Light, versatile, nope. state of the art. Gear up and save tomorrow. <laughs> nope, heavy it is. Push it to the limits and beyond. Be strong. Be relentless. Push it to the limits and beyond. Be strong. Be relentless. Rig installation program running. Program complete. Patient sedated. Initiating surgery. <laughs> That is deeply unpleasant. Oh, life is good. Everything is good, Mel. Uh, I, uh... You have been designated for disassembly. No, you've been designated for disassembly. Okay. 
press R3 to lock. Yeah, R1 use horizontal attacks. Yeah, I got it. Just asking some coffee. What? Have I tried the surge too? Dan. Dan. Think about that question for two seconds. What am I playing right now? I'm playing the Surge 1, right? If I haven't played the first one, why would I have tried the second one? Dumbass. Fucking, fucking dumb shit. Dumb. Dumb. He had to help Doggo. Uh, I already like your Doggo, and I don't even know. I don't even know anything about them. Love dogs. I love dogs. They're so cool. Um, you you missed very little. So this guy was in a wheelchair. Oh wait, which one? I keep forget. I don't. I don't intuitively know the names of the buttons. That's so awkward. Um, boom. Uh, this guy was in a wheelchair, and then he signed up to do a job for this Creo Creo company. And he... Rocket Yard! I like the name of this place. Um, so then he... Uh, he signed up to be... I signed up to be a heavy operator, because I always go tanky. <clears throat> he sat down in the surgery chair. They didn't remove his work uniform for the surgery. But then um, the sedation... I guess he... The sedating stuff didn't work, so he was awake while they drilled all this shit into his shoulders and his head and it was pretty gruesome and pretty horrible. I'm not sure how this is going to play out for the rest of the game, but that's the uh I thought you had played the first one. Dan says, "I I have walked around in it. I've gotten about this far. We're going to get to the main base here and that's about as far as I ever got. I um started out this thing when locked on Using R while holding L2 enables you to switch. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, which which one is L2? Fuck it. Um, I said at the beginning of the stream, I really liked Lords of the Fallen. And I was kind of disappointed when it was... Uh, whoa, whoa, what happened? I was kind of disappointed when, uh, uh-oh, I was kind of disappointed when I realized that they weren't planning on taking that series any farther, and this was the spiritual successor to it. Press that thing to open your backpack. Ah, okay. Um... So that was a bit disappointing, and but I wanted to see what this was all about, and I played it for a few seconds, and then I think I think at that point is when I got into uh, the Metal Gear Solid series. So everything else took a back seat to that last year when I played through the whole thing. So so uh, so here we go, and this is probably going to be a moot point. Because Darksiders Genesis comes out tomorrow, which I, of course, intend to play because I am a huge fan of Darksiders. But, uh, I don't know. This game sounds beautiful already. <laughs> yeah, it was started off pretty gruesome, but, um, we'll see if that means anything as it goes on. Power Core. <clears throat> Okay. Ah. Is Genesis the bird's eye view with the ho all the horsemen? Yes. And unfortunately, it isn't all the horsemen as I was really, really, really looking forward to. It's just war and uh, strife, apparently. Now, uh, that's the, as I understand it, it's just war and strife. But still, that's pretty good. Yeah. 
How do you? There it is. Your rig has been damaged. Its distress beacon has been triggered. You need to get back into the factory. Well, okay. I'll just stroll right on over to the factory then. I certainly don't recommend walking. But there should be a magnet station nearby. They're never far from us. I don't know you. I'm surrounded by dead people here. Maybe someone would like to explain what's going on. I'm sorry, I don't know. You need to get inside. Maybe you can make something to protect yourself. Operations always have a gear essential. The rig seems to work for me. Honestly, it's the least of my problems. I mean, I can walk. Huh. Never thought I'd be able to say that again. Well, that's good to hear, but the power core is damaged. You'll have to find a new one to make your rig fully functional. On my way. Hey, this guy's name is Warren. Ha! Uh, it's out on the the Xbox, the PlayStation, and PC, as far as I know. I think it's out on PC right now. Tomorrow, I think, is the launch of the console editions, which my PC was built in 2013, so it wouldn't play it anyway. But um, and plus, I'm I'm more partial to console. Oh, oh, look at that. Okay. Fucking asshole. Okay. Target. Oh. Okay. Target your oh. Target your enemies. One arm ahead by moving R. Okay, body, right arm, left arm, head. Ow. Fuck you. All right. Damn it, I only have the Switch, I'll play... Oh, I think it's coming out on the Switch, too. I believe it's coming out on the Switch. I also played Friends House. I'm going to the... Gallifrey one in this... Oh, cool! That's cool! Alright. This dude... Whoops! Ow. Ow. Um. There we go.
I got a power core. I'll do that later, I guess. This is not a scheduled break time. Hmm. Use the med bay to bank your collected tech scrap. If the total amount of tech scrap you own, banked and collected, is high enough, you can level up the total core power of your exo rig. All equipped gear and implants consume a portion of your total core power. All right. to database restored checking database gear voucher detected Redeemed. Oh, I got a schematic. All right, I gotta go get scrap. Gotta go get the scrap. Go get some scrap so I can make some stuff. Look out for your fellow workers. They look out for you. <clears throat> Damn. All right, I'm going to start cutting off limbs for my own purpose. schematics too god damn the finishers <laughs> hmm Piles of tech scrap can be consumed from within your inventory instantly to provide you with new tech scrap. Got it. So it's like the Lurcha clusters or whatever in uh, Darksiders 3. Whoops. Oh shit.
Oh shit. Oh no! Oh, I couldn't dodge in time. Oh, I just lost all my shit. I gotta go get it. <laughs> Continuously fighting him is not using maybe it will increase the amount of sex after you kill. Also increase the risk of losing it when you die. Yes, of course. Be careful out there. Proficiency increase one handed low. Ah, this game is pretty brutal. This is my stuff. Yep. Uh oh. Alright, I think what I'm going to do is go back to the med bay and build myself some better shit. Because I feel like I picked up a lot of tech scrap and a lot of, uh, a lot of materials. Good to see you. Oh, pneumatic helix mark one? Alright. Well, I can do this, right? Vibro cutter. 
That sounds dirty and horrifying all at the same time. Starting to lift the part now. Oh. Need more power core? Alright. All right, did that help anything? Apparently it did. What's the problem? Any more power core? What is it? <clears throat> Alright. Alright. Brother, are you still here? I will. Kick the shit out of people now. Do body from because I think I, I think I need mats for that, right? Ow. Ow. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Ow. High attack speed low, proficiency scaling low, energy gain 55%, medium, medium, medium. Food scaling very low. Alright. Fucking asshole. Oof. That is yikes. Tis but a scratch. Uh-oh. <laughs> having some uh, graphical issues there for a minute. Oh, 
All right. <laughs> My one-handed proficiency is getting better. God, that sounds wrong. That's uh, funny. I'm funny. Oh, shit. He was able to... Hmm. Oh, I got 906. Oh shit! Let me go see what I can build. Well, uh, should I? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of want to have a full set before I... Maybe I get a little bit more tech scrap. I kind of want to have a full set before I continue on. Okay. So... I got another schematic, tight. <clears throat> Remember to cut enemy body parts, getting a new cut. Yeah, that's so fucked up. The more damage a body part received, the more likely it will be cut. Very, very soon you get cut. Very, very soon you get cut. That's pretty funny. Oh! Not only is it funny looking, you can actually find stuff in this, in all this shit. Shortcuts back to operations to recover and craft new year. Tight. I can't believe they just fired Dr. Shepherds. After the years of hard work and dedication she's put into this company. I, I suppose that's what you get when you stand up for your convictions. The worrying thing is, she's right. I've seen the data. We've got to keep working, now more than ever. Lesser people would give up, but she's not one of them. A and if she won't, I won't. Oh, look at that. So go through here, and you get a little shortcut. It's kind of tight. I like this game. <coughs> Shouldn't you be at your designated work site? I'm on break. Let's see here.
All right, I need to buff up my... I need more power core. Not enough tech scrap. Okay. I don't remember this game at all, which is sad because I like what I'm seeing. It's So far, it's pretty cool. I really need to focus on getting tech scrap. So let's... We're going to do... <clears throat> we're going to do one more circuit around... These all these usual guys that we've been killing this whole time, not worrying about specific body parts. That sounds so messed up. Just worrying about tech scrap. <clears throat> Damn. Apparently 2 is, like, one of the better games of, like, the last year or whatever. Apparently this one was pretty good, but the sequel is, like, unbelievably good is what I hear. Son of a bitch. Disemboweled him. The same thing I'm going to do to you, big boy. Core power too low, overcharge failed. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I need more power core. Okay. So out here is a new area. So we're not going to do that. We're going to complete our circuit and buff up our power core and be as OP as possible before we move on to another area. And that's the bottom line because Gabe Warren said so. Brother Gabe has spoken indeed. I think I'm a little bit confused as to how some of this works. So, so if I'm crafting, okay, so that's upgrades. Legs don't come in, okay, 
Okay, I'm seeing the core consumption. Okay, three, three, three. So three, six, nine. If I have twelve out of fourteen, wait. What else is using core consumption? If that means twelve out of fourteen. Ah, uh, okay. So that would take it up to 15, which I know. Okay, I think I understand the math of this now. Let's go get more tech scrap. Oh, wait a minute. Don't I have that... Don't I have that cluster? Consumables. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Now I got more tech scrap. Now, what's the difference between banking tech scrap... Yay! Okay. Okay, so now I've got a maximum of 16, so I should be able to equip that, right? No, really? Why? Okay. Okay, that's fucking cool. But why can't I... Gear. I can't believe they just fired Dr. Shepard. Oh, that's an audio After log. The years of hard work and dedication. <sighs> hmm. I, I suppose that's what you get when you stand up for your convictions. The worrying thing is, she's right. I've seen the data. But we've got to keep oh. working now more than ever. Lesser people would give up, but she's not one of them. And if she won't, I hold on, hold on one sec, brother. You're still here. I can't do any more for you right now. You need to get back. Okay. Back to the factory. All right. Uh, guys, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna shut this down, and my brother and I are gonna play uh, Resident Evil Five together for a little bit. So. All right, Dan. Um. I'm going to shut this down, I'll get in a party with you, and um, you can broadcast it so that you're like the main guy, and uh, alright, cool. So I'm going to, hold on, hold on, just to be on the safe side. Okay, okay. I think that's I think that's good. All right. We're going to set everything up and I'll see you soon.